Number 52. What is the capacitance of a large Van de Graaff generator terminal given that it stores 8 millicoulombs of charge at a voltage of 12 megavolts? All right, so take out take a look at number, I guess, uh, 46. I went through a little detailed discussion of what a capacitor is. So here what we're going to do is just write down what we know and what we don't know. Capacitance? Who the heck knows? That's what they're asking us. So I'll put a little question mark. Next thing, charge. They told it to us. 8 millicoulombs, but you know we need that in coulombs, so simply multiply that by 10 to the minus 3. That's it in coulombs. Then the voltage. Oh, they gave it to us in megavolts. All you got to do then is take that value and multiply by 10 to the positive 6 to get it into volts. Now we need to know a formula that relates these variables together. And what is it? The capacitance of a capacitor is equal to then the charge stored across that capacitor divided then by the voltage applied to the plates of that capacitor. So if I want to solve for C, I got to know the other two, which I do. So simply just plug it on in. 8 times 10 to the minus 3 divided by 12 times 10 to the positive 6. And let's calculate 8 times 10 to the minus 3 divided by 12 times 10 to the minus, oh, times 10 to the positive 6. So here we get a value of about 6.67 times 10 to the minus 10th, and that is in farad. All right? And any other conversions from there, microfarad, microfarad excuse me, millifarad, pico, nano, whatever the heck you need, you know how to do that. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. Please remember to subscribe. Hit that like button and maybe even tell your friends. If we helped you, we might be able to help them too. Thank you so very much.